Roger, let me go. You give me code now. 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 Cody, oh. now. Oh. Now. Let it go. Are you kidding? Nobody cuts off Biggie Smalls. Hey, jackass, you want some of this? Oh. 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 Oh! What it is, guys? It is your boy Sergi, hailing from Great Mother Russia, filling in for the blessed for Miss HD yet again because he has uh, tonsillitis. You guys have been inside of my DMs on Discord, and you say to me, you must check out the American Dead clips that we have sent to you, huh? If you do not, we make unconsensual intimacy with your pet goats. Sergei cannot have this. Sergei only has goats. So Sergei is here to... to... Re <laughs> you guys have sent in American Dead compilation of funny moments and Sergei is here to review them shits. Bitches. Let us do this. Been a tough day for all of us here at The Glance. Steve Smith has now been missing for 36 hours. I'm joined by some of Steve's classmates. You look like the type of girls who do a lot of regrettable things. How does it feel today knowing you'll probably never get to hit that? Sad. Steve was really cute. I guess I just wish I could have hit that. It's so important to have sex with people before they go missing. Sergey backs up this statement. Very, very important to get inside of uh, people's hella, hella before they go missing. Very important. Kiss your mother today and let her know. Let her know something. <laughs> mm -hmm. All those girls want me? Yeah, no. Awesome! The longer I stay in this cabin, the more late I'm gonna get! Uh, yeah. Shit. More volume! I want it super big! You're doing a great job. I know I'm demanding, but I'm working on it. But it also got me where I am today. So when I ask you to make it super big, I mean make it super big, I will murder you! I'm sorry. <laughs> Work in progress. God is not finished with this gal. Hey, Genevieve, I'm all set to do my story on Garbage Island. Yeah, 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 we'll get to it. But first, I got an exclusive with the parents. Wait, what? And we're back. I'm here tonight with Stan and Francine Smith, heartbroken parents of America's missing son, Steve Smith. Stan? Francine? Why did you murder your son? What? Not ready to confess? Oh. Let's look at some statistics. 100% of the time a child goes missing, the parents did it. Legally not a fact. What are you talking about? And where'd you hide the body? We didn't hide the body. Oh. So you admit there's a body. Why are you doing this? I'm sorry, it's been a long week. Emotions are running wild. Can I get you something? A beer water, perhaps? No, thanks. That stuff gives me diarrhea. Stan, are you close with your son? No, but that doesn't mean I murdered him. Interesting. Can we play that back? I murdered him. <laughs> you son of a bitch! <laughs> we have to take a break. Beer water. It won't give you diarrhea. Just keep it natural. You guys are doing great. You're coming off super likable. Francine, how many times did you stab your son? None! Huh. Well, my team and I created a reenactment of what we believe happened the night Steve disappeared. You know what I've been thinking about lately? How Steve is the worst? Yes, I kind of want to murder him. Great idea. We'll use my knife. Hey, Mom. Hi, Dad. Just coming in here to love you. I forgive you. Terrifying what you could do with B-level camera equipment and very well thought out script. Thanks for letting me interview you for the Anne Rice Fan Club newsletter. Oh, no problem. How did you get my number again? Huh? Oh, from your high school principal. Yeah, huge Anne Rice fan. Total mo. Hi, uh, reservations for two under Roger? We don't take reservations. Excellent. Ha! 
Hold up, hold up, yo. I heard there's a new badass driver in this mug. They call him the suit. I'll tell you something right now, he crazy. Yo, yo, suit's in the house. Oh, hey, girl, holla at you, boy. I can't wait to enroll here. People are finally gonna take me seriously. Don't they have college on your planet? Yeah, but if you're not Asian, it's impossible to get in. Hey, Ethan. God, Ethan is so hot. And he completely ignores me. It makes him so much hotter. Why do women like that? What are you talking about? He totally ignored me, and I don't think he's hot at all. Ah, now I see it. Now I'm no, seeing it. No, I'm Professor Guggenheim. No. Wait, is there another G? Or is it... I'm Professor Baxter, and you'll be respecting me this semester. What are you doing? I went to talk to the dean. One lie led to another, and he asked me to teach this class. You can't teach. Quiet, please. You may have thought this class was about literature. You were wrong. This class is about life. Electric word, life. It means forever, and that's a mighty long time. But I'm here to tell you, there's something else. My office hours, they're Tuesday from 1 to 3. Mm. So, did you get that part on Ryan's Hope? No, they really like me, but they're going with someone a little more flesh-colored with a nose. Give it up, loser. Oh. I'm not a loser! <sighs> Disco's greatest hits... Best songs from 1974 to 1980? This tape is from the future, but that's impossible. On the other hand, I'm a spaceman working in a lane, so maybe I should open my mind a bit. Congratulations, you just made your first million. I'm a winner, Ma! Look at me now! Now don't look for a second. Woo! You can look again, Ma! What? Steve said you were here. Mr. President, I have something important to show you. I hope you brought your checkbook. Uh, that's our maid. Oh, fun. I love Mexicans. Dude, that rocked! Who are you? I'm Krispy Kreme McDonald's. My Krispy Kreme mama got raped by my McDonald's daddy. <gasps> Sounds like an overweight porn star. We gonna edit that out. Get out! Get out of my bedroom! Roger, thank God. Where were you? You didn't come home last night. Oh, I was well looked after, Stephen. I found a new boy. A boy who won me something worth 750 tickets at the arcade. Oh. That's more than you make in a year. Boy, Ooh. I have never told a guy about my nose job on the first date before. It's a good first date. What do you think about maybe doing it again? Jerry, will you marry me? It's Shari, and yes! Oh, Jacob, you have made me so happy. Ma, you won't believe it. He asked me to marry him. Yes, the orthodontist. Brandeis. Reformed. Ashkenazi. Haven't seen the car. I know. Is it great? We did it, Ma. We finally did it. Over here. <laughs> Ugh, what is that? A Manhattan. I feel great. Timmy, it's not nice to point. But he doesn't have a nose. Mm. He can't help it if he's deformed. Oh. Deformed? I'm just as God made me, madam. <laughs> Motherfucker. Bacon. Stir of Echo. Tremors won three Saturn Awards. What's a Saturn Award? You're missing the point. You're right. Sorry. That's Kevin Bacon. They think you're Kevin Bacon. Yes, Haley. I understand things that happen around me. Is it bad that he really looks like Kevin Bacon? Did someone order a sexy Persian wingman? Let's go. I gotta keep moving or these pants will cut off my circulation and my legs will die. I, I'm just gonna go. Ah, oh, thank God. That guy sucked so much. I only invited him because our folks had to escape Tehran together. We left everything behind. Our house, our cars, my little brother. Oh my God, this is my song! I totally asked him to play this! What? what? What's going on? I'm Steve's cousin. I tripped on your walkway and I need compensation. I'll take a check. And I'll need two forms of ID. Passport's okay, or a utility bill with your current... You know what? You're boring me. Make it a thousand cash. You get paid to look honest. 
cup of your hottest coffee, please. Remember, you're the face, I'm the brain. Ow, this cup is irresponsibly hot. Oh, my face! Oh. 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 <laughs> exactly. God, baby, your back is so toned. Oh, my lats. Yeah, the electric can opener broke. I've been opening them manually. With these big, strong hands, oh, they make me feel so safe. Thanks. Cans again. I'll tell you the cans I like. Oh, sassy hands. Don't just get one cheek, girl. Other side. You poached my bear. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? I'm taking my bounty back. Ah! What's your problem? Oh, you mean besides being shot at by a bottom-heavy freak? <gasps> you know it's awkward when I try to jog. Recent rumblings from the art world suggest the market should decide this one. I'll be holding the auction this Saturday. <gasps> oh. Whoever heard of a sad clown? Will you tell my fortune? Steve, before she tells you your future, let me tell you her past. 40 years of alcoholism and three doctorless abortions. You are a sad, angry little person. Hello, sharper image. Yeah, give me three Sopranos pinball machines, the radio golf ball, a floating ant farm, a flashlight hammer to smash the ants with if they piss me off. I'm, uh, I'm gonna call right back. What the hell is that? Now, while I hacked the database, you create a diversion. <gasps> a diversion? Oh, this is a caper, like... Ah, uh, hate virgins. Maybe. In the movies. Speaking of movies, you ever seen Man on Fire? Is that the one with the... Oh, I suppose you have a better backstory? My name is Braff Zecklin. I was an international race car driver. One day, a baby carriage rolled out onto the track, so I swerved into the retaining wall to avoid it. The car burst into flames, but the baby miraculously survived. I was that baby. That doesn't make any sense. I'm Braff Zecklin! I'm playing poker tonight with a couple of guys from work. We need a fourth, so Chili's coming along. Chili? You heard right, baby. They call me Chili because I got ice in my veins. What's with these cards, Bad Larry? You're screwing me with these cards! D did I clean my toilet with a washcloth and then jam it into your mother's mouth? What? Because that's what you're doing to me! <clears throat> Hello to a well-behaved fellow who's very sorry. I'm very sorry. I know I've been a real pain, but I'm going to be super nice from now on. I trust you'll enjoy my spa, Mr. Stan Smith of the CIA. In fact, you'll like it so much, you'll never leave. <laughs> oh my god, you smell that? I had a pickle an hour ago. Came with my Reuben. I'm so fat. Now, who does Betty know me as? Cousin Phil, number 302. That woman's manipulative. She uses her personal drama as an excuse to come here, take over Stan's life, and elbow me out. Threatened by the visiting mother-in-law. Cliché. Oh. Tacos! Oh. Who's crying? <laughs> I'll have you know I studied at the feet of the master, Dr. Phil. It's Oprah approved. Oprah, 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 Oprah! My card. The only currency I accept is the joy I get from helping my patients. This is a seven of diamonds. Yeah, you're gonna have to write my fake phone number down on that. Klondike 52487. I'm a ninja, everybody! I'm doing ninja stuff now! D-Day, 1944. You think about the bravery, the heroism that happened here. It's just humbling. Men younger than us, boys, really. Just boys. Trying to fight off an American invasion. I, I was talking about the Americans. Uh, the Germans were brave, too. Less brave, maybe. You'll be answering to Peters now. Give him anything he needs. Guess I'm the boss of you. What's your name? Stan. Hmm, I already know a Stan. I'm gonna call you Mortimer. Now run and fix me a coffee. Today, Mortimer James. I have the middle name when I'm disappointed in him. Name's Luke Fondelberg. Just started today. Any hot pieces of tail around this office that like a good groping? You see that episode of Seinfeld Thursday night ten years ago? 
You wanted to stay me? Fondleberg, did you sexually harass Miss Vanderboobin? You bet your ass I did. I harassed the crap out of her. Damn it. Now we have to pay her a settlement. You're fired! Both of those things work for me. See you in hell. He's king. He's king. That spring break sucks. I could throw a better spring break than that loser. I'm Scotch Bingington, the true king of spring break. My scepter shoots shivers! And this end dispenses Luden's cough drops. I'm fighting something. <laughs> what? What? What's, what's going on? My tequila! That worm had a name! Now, if you will excuse me, I am late for my daughter's arranged wedding. She will learn to love him. May I help you? Yes, I'm looking for a Judy Panowitz. What a coincidence! Lonesome glove, why can I never find your mate? Did I donate it to that soldier I read about who lost his arm in Iraq? No, I would have remembered getting a sloppily written thank you note. I can't find my dinosaur stickers. Well, you'll have to look for them yourself. AJ has a boo-boo. I have a boo-boo, too. You did that on purpose. Roger, what the hell? I would have never... You're supposed to fight him for that. You don't let him do that. Or come down <laughs> here if you hadn't declared this the summer of exotic adventure. Ah, Chinatown. Where you could tell me it was Japantown or Koreatown, and I'd nod and smile. Delivery for the Phantom of the Telethon. Oh, my God, my pipe organ, yay! This is what I'm supposed to play maniacally down in the catacombs? Oh, what'd you think you were getting for thirty nine ninety five? No, no, this is totally unacceptable. Ah. Oh. 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 Yeah, I can oh. work with this. How often does Roger win free passes to a first-class spa? Oh, once isn't enough? No, Roger, I meant it as a good thing. Well, that's not how it sounded. You have a way about you, Haley, that just... Yeah, turns me off. Ow! She bit me! What? <gasps> you were gonna let me die for $1,800? No! Yes. No. Not now, Steven. I have a meeting in, like, one minute. Pretend to be my assistant. And if this guy asks, my name is... Freddie Underwood! Porn screenwriter extraordinaire! Helicopter Perry, the sleaziest porn producer east of Van Nuys. Come here, you son of a bitch bastard. So, how's the smut business, HP? The internet's killing me, Freddy. Every frat boy with a digital camera thinks he's a filmmaker now. I've seen what you speak of. Dumpster sluts and the like. There's no art in it anymore. When can we see it? Oh, no, no, you will not be attending this abortion. Ugh, the director's an idiot, the lead can barely speak English, and the second lead is 30 pounds overweight. P.S. I'm the second lead and I'm starving. Okay, first of all, I don't believe in any of this therapy nonsense. <gasps> the Logans! Oh my God, the Logans! They were the first family I ever lived with and then they abandoned me years ago and I haven't been able to trust anybody ever since. Thank you, doctor. You are a miracle worker. You see that, people? That's how you share. That's a freaking breakthrough. You make me sick. <laughs> I need to know. <laughs> Why did you leave me like that? You rented a room from us and refused to pay. I paid you in laughter! <laughs> we were afraid of you! Bruh, I've had people do this to me. <laughs> like, you let them stay with you, and you take care of them or whatever, and when you throw them out because they act like douchebags, they try to flip it and say, you did horrible stuff. It, it never surprises me, really. It's hilarious. <laughs> That's how you share. That's a freaking breakthrough. You make me sick. <laughs> I need to know. Sick. Why did you leave me like that? You rented a room from us and refused to pay. I paid you in laughter. We were afraid of you. Jenny, you better shut up right now or I will cut your face. If it's the same Roger who takes his pints down at the cat and the fiddle, he is prone to disguises. I also hear he's wanted in a string of prostitute murders he is. On. And the club foot. I have everything down. Oh, do you? Indeed. What's my favorite breakfast sausage? Vice first. With? Sauerkraut. Also with? Hefeweizen. Baseball player? Show and vice. Tennis racket? Schlesinger. Made up word. Scheigelbarben. I have nothing left to teach you. You are ready for the inheritance, lawyers. Oh, wait, there is something else you should know. I bedazzled my genitalia. Ah, then we have a happy coincidence going on here. 
Roy Rogers McFreely's the name, chairing the homeowners associations, my game. Yes, I know what you're thinking, but the jacket is vintage. You won't be able to find one anywhere. I need to have this form signed by the owner of a real business. This is a real business, to wit. Ew, it's filled with fingernail clippings. I mix them in with the wasabi peas, no one notices. I also have a business license. Probably should have started with that. Fine, Mr. Calhoun, I'll get right on it. Great, and after that, you can clean my pants up, because I just missed a Belvedere myself. Google it. I am Dmitry Garabedian, a high-ranking member of the Armenian Mafia. Roger's place pays us for protection. You recognize this woman? That's Constance Mathers. Where did you get this picture? The security camera. So I killed her. You can't do that! It is already done. Captain Francois Dubonnet, French Interpol. I have devoted ten years of my life to toppling your criminal empire, Madame Marouche. Your reign of terror is over. And I am Raoul. You are too old and barren. I am leaving you for a real woman who can bear me a son. Damn, her titties long as shit. I once knew a female whose boobs went to her kneecaps. When she came out of her bedroom, she was wearing a really long t-shirt that didn't go down to her kneecaps. But her titties did, though. <laughs> And whenever she would walk, she would sway. And they would dangle like this far up under her shirt. I couldn't say nothing to her because it was my homeboy's sister. And it's messed up because I heard her before I saw her titties. And I was like hella attracted to her voice. And now it makes sense because if your titties is that long, your voice better be your fucking point. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> After like 30 minutes of flirting with this bitch, I turned around to see her long ass titties. And after that, she kept trying to hit on me because I was we were talking back nasty. And I had to just turn it all off. Just never talk back to her. <laughs> I can't even do it, bro. And I am Toro, Raul's half-bull son from the future. My father's other testicle became stronger and he met it with a bull to conceive me. Are you Lucius Mayweather? Who wants to know? Roger, what, what the hell? Roger? No, Lucius. You must be the white boy looking for a wheel man. I'm in. For God's sakes, I'm assembling my own crew. That cracker's got a crack in his head if you ask me. You hustling me, boy? Barry, ah! Hershey, you know my ah! uncle Roger. Ah! Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, my mom's side. Ah, and what Steve wants. You hustling me, boy? <laughs> oh, no, is that I have my own plan. While everyone's focused on snot, I'll be heading to the bathroom to share a doobie with the busboy in exchange for an angry handy jay. I show hush bomb for the defense. <sighs> Don't you worry, kid. I'll win this for you. We'll get your foreskin cut off, all right. What? And who shot Gianni Versace? Was it a Jew? I don't know. It was in Miami. Mail call. Per usual, I opened and read everything. You're welcome. Franny, you got some cleaning coupons, because that's what you do. And Klaus, you got nothing, because people think you're dead. You know, you don't have to say that every time. You could just not hand me anything. I can explain. A DeLorean? <gasps> Are you running Coke? No. I get it. We'll talk later. I'm good for half a key. Tonight is going to be so much fun. I feel like the belle of the ball. Yeah, well, I'm the belle of the ball, so you can feel however you want. <gasps> Hello. Oh, I says hell. Half the petty officers in the 7th Fleet could have fathered that kid. Why am I the one that's got to pay to fix his cleft palate? But the whole thing was messy, so I jumped ship in Okinawa, caught a flight home, got back last night. Anywho, what's got you so glum? Oh, good lord, it's real. You know, Stan, it's too bad. I actually liked Francine. The rest of them can suck it, but Francine, I'm sorry to see die. Anytime I want, I could let out some bad wieners. Say, Stan, I'm the decider again. Oh, yeah? Oh, where, where do you keep these alleged death dogs? Well, they're not here. They're someplace safe. Someplace you'll never guess. The last place you would ever think to look. No, 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 don't look in the fridge. They're not in there. The hell are you inquire? Roger, let me go. You give me code now! 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 Oh. Now! Oh. Now! 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 Oh! Yeah! 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 I'm waiting for my buddy so he can tell me if these look good. Should be just a few more minutes. 
you know, you don't, you don't need to stand there. I'll, I'll tell them you helped me. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks. Are we gonna fool around? Only the best for my good friend. Oh, look at the friendly locals. Hola. Stan, put my brooches in the room safe. Okay, you were right. They were gonna kill me. Is that pee? I can't believe you sacrificed your helicopter for me. Is the whole place peed on? I sacrificed it for my friend. Who peed on the city? Stan, Stan Smith. I'm, you know, I'm, I'm having trouble getting his voice right. You, you know what? I'm just gonna make him sound like Sean Connery. Sweetheart, I'll have a mango teeny shaken, not stirred. Stirred. Is that how I say it? Stirred. Why are you still here? Is food appropriate for a small dog? Oh, ma'am, I'm not qualified to answer that. See, I only have one mouse on my name tag, which means I do stocking, lifting, and the like. You need to talk to someone with at least one dog. See, it goes one mouse, two mouse, one bird, two bird, then one dog, then two dog. I hear there's a guy up in Portland with three dogs, but I think that's just an office rumor. Wouldn't it be something if it was true, though? Hey, Roger! What's going on? Not much. Just boring myself and this old broad. Relax, MC Raw G. Let it go. Are you kidding? Nobody cuts off Biggie Smalls. <laughs> hey, jackass, you want some of this? Oh! 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 So oh, first, just a medical oh, question. Where oh, have you been going to the bathroom? What? It's just that these are new socks, and I paid extra for monogramming is all. See? That's not a monogram, that's a penguin. My name is Dr. Penguin. What's happening? I was just about to do something really funny. I'll tell you what's happening. It's the end of the world, and we've been left behind. Oh my god. The homeless guy from the bus station is hung. But I knew that. Whoa, is that rich? Can't have too much of that. Another very bad race, Clancy. I'm Clancy. Sorry, Mr. McCormick. We'll do better next week. Unfortunately, there isn't going to be a next week. Mr. McCormick, no! Ah, uh, sorry, Clancy. The only way I can recruit my losses on this horse is to shoot it in the face and collect the life insurance I took out when I married it. What? Uh, Mother... Hey! I didn't get to do that earlier. Stop telling Francine on me! Ouch! So we just gonna breeze past the fact that he's boning the horse. We just go breeze past that. Okay. All right. Okay. No, I, I see. Jeez, that really hurt. Ah, oh, crap. Can I help you? I had an appointment with the horse whisperer. Oh, yes. He'll be right with you. Thank God I'm just his secretary. I'm an associate. Oh, boy. What type of Cut. shit? Cut! Awful! Who are you? The name's Ira Siegel. Why is the fat guy the female? <laughs> oh, God. I directed the episode of Sybil where Christine Baranski sat on her balls. Point is, I can direct this thing. Look how many pockets are on his jacket. I think we should let him do it. I know who Chex Limino is, and you're not him. That's because you're not seeing me in my outfit. Eh? Yeah? Recognize me now? Mustache, courtesy of an L.L. Bean mannequin named of Frederick. Ah, an alien and a mannequin. What were we thinking? We were young. The Smithsesses takes the precious from us. The Smithsesses. <laughs> oh, shit. Precious is ours. As... Oh, what a beautiful rings is. Wait, this turns people invisible? Who needs to be invisible in the middle of nowhere? Where were you when I farted at Danny's wedding? No! Please! Roger, help! Oh no. Oh my god. Oh please, no. No, no, no! Wow! Oh, I'm falling! Somebody, please! My name is Clive Trotter and I'm an American and I am in trouble! Lucas, how'd you do? Oh, that's excellent. I probably got an A though. You should study with me next time. Maybe order in a pizza and a two-liter. What do you like, Sprite? I sure do. What? No way! Wait, why is this wrong? 
Next to Miranda rights, I put Miranda has the right to a decent man who will help her raise her baby. Are these questions not about sex in the city? Lucas, why won't you tell me what kind of soda you like? If you had been in that parking lot, you would have kicked that mugger's ass. He humiliated me. I'm tired of being weak. Help me. I've been waiting to hear those words for a long time. I just pray they would come from my son and not an alien in a sports bra. It's a support tank. It's too small. It rode up my belly. So, you wanted to have lunch. Well, here I am. Thanks for ordering me a drink. That's the cream. That explains why I went down creamy. This is exactly what we're talking about. Stan, will you put mine on? You've made me so happy. Look, they've got a wine train. We can ride. Wait, can we ride it? It's a small train that goes through the vineyards and carries passengers. Yes, we can ride the wine train. Choo-choo! Don't do that. You guys see my rad new camera? I'm pursuing a newfound passion. Crime scene photography. Ooh, like the guys on CSI? Yes, Klaus. Remember we were watching CSI together and I was like, I want to do that. And you were like, you totally should. Ring a bell? Not at all. Are you sure you weren't just high on angel dust talking to the ceiling fan? Oh, that's right. Hello, y'all. I'm Stan Smith's brother, Appleby McFridays. Do I smell kreplach? Hey, Rabbi, I got a joke for you. Two priests are hitting on an altar boy. Uh, hello, guy who mistakenly believes he's my brother. Roger, what happened? Well, I guess sometimes a hole in a men's room stall is just a hole in a men's room stall. I've got a plan. Does that plan include explaining why a footless blind man is giving an expert Bajowski to our baggage handler? Expert Bajowski? Admire the skills. I want a roast. Roger, do you even know what a roast is? Of course I do. I was a member of the Friars Club in the 60s. I drove Phyllis Diller to two of her first three abortions. She must have such regret never getting her driver's license. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have my bowling league tonight. I'm a roly turkey tonight, Hesse. <laughs> Why? Why would you do this? What, what did I ever do to any of you to make you say those incredibly hurtful things? Are you serious? Does it look like I'm not serious? Who's that positive girl with you? This is Allie, my life coach. She also works at Jumbo Juice. She gave me a fiber boost, then she gave me a life boost. Shit, looking like that, she could, she could work. I got some work for her. <laughs> yep, oh boy. She has weird energy, doesn't she? No, no, she has <gasps> good energy. Haley, no, it's Roger. Roger, can like I call that. you back? You don't have to. I'm right next to you. You didn't see me setting all this stuff up? Now we're in the same scene. <laughs> Thanks, Don. I'm done with this. Roger? What the hell are you doing in Thailand? Oh, my God. It worked. Thailand, huh? I'd like three 12-year-old boys, no MSG. Usually when I see men in cages, they're kissing each other, and I'm throwing pesos at them. Peso! Kiss! Kiss! Peso! Roger, what are you doing? Signing you up for an adult literacy class. Nocturnal Petting Zoo. Get out of here! I warned you, Dugan! Dugan, there's urine in this bottle! How they do it? From Egypt to France, a big bold step called the Confidence! You're fired! You can't fire me from my own restaurant! Actually, it's all mine! The bank wouldn't lend you 50 cents! The restaurant, the truck, the napkin holders, they're all mine! But to show you I'm a good guy, I got you this. Ta-da! The perfect split. You like that? Get off my property. What can I get you, Mac? Uh, I'm meeting friends at- Can I use your crap? Get out of here! There's a bathroom in the park! The service here sucks! Have you even seen a waiter? What am I doing? This isn't helping me. If that's really from our kitchen, then you can eat the plate. With a roach on it? Oh. Oh, God. Why is he eating the plate with the roach Delicious. on it? Delicious! Uh, I'll pronounce you man, fish, and wife. Now for my payment. Mother Hog! Pleasure doing business with you. All you need is a manager and you're on your way. I wouldn't even know where to begin to find it. Sweeps McCullough, talent manager. I used to represent every sitcom neighbor and sidekick in the 80s. I discovered Mindy Cohn, Willie Ames, the slow kid from Life Goes On, 
Was that a comedy? Was to me. Butterfly knife and a hustler. Thanks, Uncle Cappy. I'm not Uncle Cappy just yet. I still have to get drunk. Now I'd like to call Mr. Sugar to the stand. Guess who's the luckiest guy in the courtroom? Bert, because he gets to watch my big round ass as I walk to the stand. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Bob Danilou. I make gluten-free desserts. Not gonna lie, we're struggling at the moment. Oh my god, he is so guilty. You're voting guilty, right? You can't know he's guilty yet. Everyone's guilty of something. You're guilty of having incredibly kissable lips. Oh, they're plump and sweet like ripe cherries. I'll vote guilty if you want me to. Of course you will. But I've got a random question. Do you sell watch batteries? Get out. They're totally safe, and you look fantastic. <laughs> does liquor really do that? Like, does liquor really take an ugly person and make them hot? Farted. This guy! <laughs> Motherfucker! Hi, Sarah. Pete Pendleman, concrete man out of Sheboygan. Let's walk and talk. Roger? Damn it, it didn't work. Who's Roger? The name's Reaganomics Lamborghini, jacuzzi dealer. Wanna smoke cocaine out of my pipe made from a Rubik's Cube? Ah! I remember the good old days when Twitter was just another word for late night beaver down by the creek. I need some peanuts and cracker jacks. I don't care if I. Wait! What are we doing? I want to talk about my dad! I don't even like baseball! Well, me neither. I thought you wanted to go. I'm Ace Chapman, star forward. For... Wait, does it have to be consensual sex? Yes. Okay, well then, you definitely don't want Ace. <laughs> oh, oh, don't take those. You will be conscious but paralyzed for 12 hours. Bing Cooper, sexually active high school senior. I've pulled more tail than a slow kid at a petting zoo. Have a good day at school, son. I'm already having a good day because you called me son. Now give me a kiss. Kiss me on the lips, Dad. I want that kind of relationship with you. I'll punch a child in the mouth. With you. Punch him in the face. You thought about it. Punch I saw him in it. The, punch him in the face. All these people walking around without bags. Buy something. You're killing this mall. How's your pretzel? Good. I brought it from home. Hey, this feels good. Do you like it? Don't tell anyone. You'll get in trouble, too. Stop. Where's Roger? I left in the middle of the song. It turned into all gibberish, and I won't be a part of it. Hey, Ginger Scoops, I was looking at nudie mags in that field, and I need you to check me for ticks. Anything? They're tough to see. You just concentrate on being the creative force God made you and leave the rest to me. To our new business! To our new... Ah! These are a lot stronger than when I was a kid. Hey, Roger. Yeah? I'm rooting for you. I know, Steve. You always were. I knew it wasn't true. The classes, the girlfriend, the sobriety. It was all a lie. That's why I wasn't surprised to read in the paper that he had OD'd not ten seconds later. <laughs> Our next performer is new on the country scene. Give a warm welcome to Mr. Cuss Mustard! Thank you kindly. I love drinking and race cars and big old fat women. And Jesus is awesome, he rose on Thanksgiving. Ah, ah, you, I saw you. Hey, what happened to being a country singer? Oh, living the honky-tonk life was too hard. I'm doing calypso dancing now. Oh, damn it, Asian! Dad, I'm gonna be late! Yeah, say, could I get that sweatshirt back from you? It looks pretty nasty out there. Maybe I could just wear it and give it back to you next time. Yeah, it's just, it's kind of my favorite, you know, from college. I'll wash it for you. I just want to wear it for a while. Ah, <sighs> it smells like us. Ugh. No, 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 no. That's the no. dude I was telling. If a girl ever does that to you inside of your room, a girl that says that to you, you can pretty much just ask her to go take a shower with you or just to take off her pants right there you no. about while we were playing army no. guys oh the weird shorts no. guy he no. comes in every weekend tries on all the shorts no. and never buys anything mm. where's a mirror
magnificent. Where did you get it? Oh, I got a great deal. This limo company went out of business. Ah, oh, you know damn well I stole it. You doing the Nigerian medical student? Yep. First one in my village to pretend to become a doctor. Name's Dan Ansome Handsome. You're the most stunning woman I've ever seen. Ah, uh, I'm Scarlet. <clears throat> it's almost ready. Just need to do the final test. What did he invent, fentanyl or something? Good lord. Yes. Yes, Perfect. Indeed. Yes, my son? Roger, what are you doing? While well, you were talking so much about this, it sounded like fun. It's not, but it was a good excuse to work on my abs. And my savior bulge. Jeff, you don't do coke, do you? Cool, me neither. Quilo! Quilo, cape or no cape? Which one of you doesn't want the cape? Oh no, we both do. We're, we're just arguing about who loves them more. You won't be undersold. Try this same camcorder at Monty's for $20 less. Do you have your receipt? No, I don't have a receipt. I stole the floor model. You can't be the masked hero. I refuse to answer any questions without my lawyer present. <laughs> a bird distracted me on my backswing. It was going, kick, kick, kick. That's not my name, and it was saying it right at me. Yes, yes Mr. Mr. Vanderhill. Vanderhill. Oh! Oh my god, you stupid bitch, why did you drop me? I can't breathe, why can't you do that move? You stupid bitch, I'll kill you! How long has this been here? Construction of the museum began in 1998. I should know, because like Ross on Friends, I'm a docent. But unlike Ross, I don't look like a Monchichi. Somebody beat up Snot! Uh, aren't you Snot? I'm Barry! Stan, I might have got the wrong one. Dmitry Crutch licked me off. New exchange student from Russia. A uh, word of caution, I would refrain from sharing popcorn with a gentleman to your left, as I saw him cut a hole in the bottom of his bucket. Aha, he's kidding. Popcorn? Don't worry about the boy. He drives so smooth you can boil an egg on the engine. When we bring the car back, I'll peel the egg for you. We're not having a real conversation. <laughs> are we? You're, you're just waiting for me to finish so you can say your next thing. Freddy, you're no special. <laughs> oh, come on, man. You don't have to do this. <laughs> Bro, the reason why that made me laugh so much is because I feel like when I be talking to a lot of people out there, they get that notion from me. Like, yo, we're not having a real conversation, are we? You're just... You're just waiting until I stop talking so you can say your next line. Because <laughs> that's exactly what it is. <laughs> <That's date. laughs> oh, man. This book is all about reconnecting. Elyon? Is that you, baby? Elyon. Come on in. You're safe here. I will not send you back to Cuba. Motherfucker. Ricky Spash. Oh, no. Ricky no. Well, that's, that's not that bad. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> 97 Toyota Camry. Only 32 made in the world. Jose! Sam! <laughs> Bon ami. Hi, I'm Christopher, and this is my adopted daughter, Opal Louise. We are having quite a day. My Prius's nickel battery is acting up, my iPhone's as dead as Farrah Fawcett, and my life partner, Michael, is at a Grey Goose event in Reykjavik. Can I use your phone? Get in my house now. This place is just what Langley Falls needs.
A chic lounge environment for young professionals. If they need it so much, how come there's nobody here? I'm gonna eat you one day. Roger, what are you- No! Steve, I freaked out! Hey, babe. Let's go try that weird skiing that's like this. Remind me to never take this hat off. I got everything held together up there with a chip clip. Hello there. I'm George Hamilton 20 years ago. Oh my god, I loved you. Would you like to play a set of tennis? Actually, she's with me. Oh, I see. Hey, how about we play a new game? What's in our fanny packs? I have a scorecard from my last round of golf. I shot a 206 and a half full Subway sandwich card. What's in yours? I don't think that's any of your- Zip! Well, that's a strange thing to carry around. I like to leave mine in the toilet. And now I'm going to turn on the water and you're going to feel a little pressure. Yeah, it's good. Real good. Mm. Uh, you can turn it up a bit. All the way. This ain't my first butt blast. What are you doing? What are you- Oh, oh my- You know what, Ladon? Turn it down just a little. What's the matter, Franny? You look troubled. Sean Ian, I'm just going to adjust your arm to the right a bit. How does that feel? Good? Good. Okay, now I'm just going to put my thumb in your mouth. What? How does that feel? No! Good. Good. Shut it down, pack it up. What? Of course, it's not the original Niagara Falls, which burned down in 1816. This is getting ridiculous. You want me to walk you home again? It didn't help last time. He's just trying to help the kid out. I'm going to rape him this time. Evening, sir. I'm here for Mr. and Mrs. For display purposes only. This is not a real cell phone. God, naked men look so stupid in shoes. I do look pretty dumb. Women look hot wearing only shoes. Yeah, because they make kick-ass female stripper shoes. Meanwhile, no one's making... Male stripper shoes? My eyes! Not again! Ow! 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 Look at this. What a cool biplane. Giuseppe, did you draw this? See, si, see, si, trace. I, I trace. What? I traced it. Mardi Gras, bitches! I'm having a party at my bar. I got beads aplenty, so I want to see all your tatas. Except you, Haley. You have the worst boobs. They're, they're like 90% nips, like two dark castles with tiny little moats. Damn. 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 You were smashed, man. You kept high-fiving that black guy. He was not into it. My man! Up top! My dog! Twill Anjan Bone. It's just you? Where is everybody? Hey, could you pull over for a sec? I did it! <laughs> oh my god, what a gorgeous trophy! And flowers? Wait, I can't hold everything. I'm gonna have my friend hold my cone. It's five in the morning. What are you doing? Why, I'm getting ready to go to the dig site. Come on, Roger. What are you really doing? Well, why don't I show you? I, I knew we had to start south, where an ancient tribe would have a fresh water source. How do you know all this? Well, hell, Francine. I'm an archaeologist. Why do you keep leaning in when I say stuff? Take off your shirt and throw it to me. It's disgusting. You got the part. No, 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 no. Eyes on me. One and two and kick and tush and kick and push and finger, 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 finger. <sighs> well, that's over. Oh, damn it! You, you following my daughter? Screw you, buddy! Get out of here, you pervert! Your weird daughter made me miss the zeros! She, she made me miss the thing! You freako! I don't know what you're talking about! Get back in your house! Get back in your damn house! Relax, people will show. I mean, we're the only game in town, right? I mean, it's not like there's anyone else in Langley Falls working their asses off to keep alive the orchestral folk traditions of Tsarist Russia! Nerd Squad, I'm Trevor. Your wife called, your TV's out. Oh, Roger, awesome! I said it's Trevor. Wait, do you really know what you're doing, or is this just a disguise? Sir, I have a family, too, that I would like to spend Thanksgiving with, so if you could just show me your TV. Sorry, Haley. I've made other dessert plans.
Haley, you didn't think I was going to let Big Wang slip through my fingers, did you? Come on, I still got two big installs tonight, but only one more job to do if you get my drift. <laughs> Gotta watch out for them Thai lady boys, man. Gotta watch out indeed. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Share the Twisms.